Yes, it's finally here, people. Volumetric lighting. Ta-da! So, what's going on here? So, we got a light in the scene, which we can quite easily identify where it comes from. It's basically that bit over there. And for that light, we cast uh, basically like a volume over the scene. So, we can actually render like where the rays of light interact with the air particles and such which gives like this brilliant and very nice effect to the game which can be used to good, good effect now you can see that like in bits where there's like shadow there's like no light or anything from the ground whereas outside of the area I would actually can see the, uh, the lights playing apart and you can also see that when you move across we see the light interacting so if from our point of view, we pass through like multiple bits of light, uh, it appears to be brighter on that location, which is a very nice effect. Now, how this effect is accomplished is what we do, we render the scene normally without this polymetric light at all, which would just give like the scene and the shadows as normal. The second pass, what we do from a light point of view, we look at the scene and we create a depth map. So we know how basically the depth of every pixel in the, in the scene. And we essentially construct a mesh that essentially molds itself around the obstacles in the scene and the uh, shape of the light. So I'm actually a pyramid, which begins at the light source just in front of it. And will then basically extend into the scene up until it either like reaches a point where it collides with or goes all the way through as you can see in, in the back. Uh, and that pyramid will basically become the light mesh. Now what we do then is taking this uh, this pyramid called mesh, we then determine from the camera point of view, so what we're looking at now, uh, for every pixel how much light every pixel travels through. Uh, and with given that information, we can then solve a integral, which can then determine the light value for that part of the uh, of the scene. Now, in this example, I just use like a, a linear equation to solve what color the light should be, which is not how real I am, uh, how basically that works. But I just want to show you guys the effect before I get into like the, the maps and stuff, all of that to basically like a more realistic uh, effect. And as you can see. It, it's, I think it's, it's very nice. I think it's a really nice cool effect which can definitely be used in like upcoming games and such. Uh, there's still a few bugs like this black thing in the sky and there's other things which don't work quite well. Uh, but overall it's quite like a neat effect. I'm uh, quite happy with the result so far, but it needs some improvements. Uh, that's it. Uh, keep posted and thanks for watching. Cheers.